Okay, this time we are going to download Visual Studio Code. So this Visual Studio Code is an IDE or Integrated Development Kit. This is where we are going to write our Python file and the Django project. Actually, we can also write our codes or file or Python file using the command prompt. Okay, over here, you can write Python. Kaya naka-download ako sa Python. Naka-download na kita. So, Python. Okay, then you can write, let's say, print. Okay, hello world. Then, enter. Okay, automatically, you will see the output hello world. Okay, so... Instead of writing your file or your Python codes over here in the command prompt, I'll, I'll be going to teach you on how to write our file using the Visual Studio Code. But before that, of course, we need to download our Visual Studio Code. So you click your browser and then write Visual Studio Code. Visual Studio Code. And then click Visual Studio Code Editing. And then over here, you can see the download for Windows. Okay, but if you have a different operating system like Mac OS or Linux, so you can choose over here. So since a uh, majority of us are using Windows, so you can click here. Or you can directly click Download Windows for Windows. So, actually, na-download ko na ni siya. So, after downloading the Visual Studio Code, you can go to the uh, Downloads and then double-click this executable and then click I accept the agreement to continue uh, installing the Visual Studio Code. Okay, click Next. So, you can as is this one. But if you want to change the location of your Visual Studio Code installation, so you can click the Browse. And then in my case, like for example, I'm going to install my Visual Studio Code in local C uh, folder Python para updanay sila. Then click OK. Then click Next. So you have the option whether you are going to continue if you would like to select a different folder or I mean you can create uh, programs shortcuts in the start menu folder so naka default na siya but if you don't like to have the program or icon in the start menu so you click don't uh, create the start menu but I suggest that you don't click this one as is lang sa continue na to nga may Kita, my program icon sa start menu folder para mag if you want to open your as uh, Visual Studio Clo, uh, Visual Studio Code i-click lang natin ang start menu para makita natin ang Microsoft Visual Studio Code then click next and then additional tasks so aside from having the program in the start menu you can also have a shortcut icon in our desktop so you just create uh, you just click create a desktop icon and you can also add open with code open mo ang code mo sa windows explorer okay optional man lang eh. and then click next okay then install Okay, click finish. Okay, this one. Okay. So we have the different i uh, different icons over here. So the first icon is the explorer. 
So you can use this to open your folder or to create folder. So this one is used to search your file. And this one is used to control your source code. And this one is used to run or debug your program. And this one is used to download your extension. So like, and this one is used for testing. So if you are, if this is your first time to open your, or to install your Visual Studio code, so you need to download the Python extensions. So you click natin ng Python extensions, and then it type lang natin ang Python. So amo ning una gid makita natin is python nt license linten so i-click ni naton and then makita natin diri install so i-click lang natin install so in my case na install ko na okay dapat i-install yon ni ang python extension para may connection ang aton nga python with the visual studio code Ayan. So, para makaobra kita din sa aton nga program sa aton nga Visual Studio Code program sa aton nga Python. Okay? So, ang muna aton nga, ano, this is our IDE or Integrity Development Kit. So, I already mentioned a while ago. So, instead of writing your Python codes in the command prompt, diri na lang sa Visual Studio Code. Kaya diri damo kita maobra. Okay? Okay, let's start writing our visual, uh, let's start writing our Python file. So, as you can see, over here at uh, the lower portion, you can also see the console, the terminal. So, there is uh, the loom. So, you can click open folder. Okay, then over here so in my case i have already my own folder python project but if this is your first time to write your folder you can click new then you can write your folder then select folder okay so on python project let's select folder so yes i trust the authors so, like for example, I'm going to create new file. Okay. Then I'm going to write sample. Okay. Sample Python. So, that pi. So the the file the file name the file name should have a that extension that our python file should have a dot pi so the dot pi is the python extension so para mabalaan ni compiler nga this is the product of python so dapat putan na natin sang extension nga dot pi okay so like for example let's say uh, print Hello world. And then go to here. So run and debug. Okay. Then click run and debug. Okay. Python file. Okay. You can see here the output. Hello world. Okay. Hello world. So. Run the game. Rent. Kamusta? Okay. You can use this one, the icon, the run icon. Okay, click. Okay, we have here the output, hello world, kamusta? Okay, that's it. Thank you.